Um, hello everybody. Um, today I wanted to make a video to kind of reference some questions I've gotten about my website and the accuracy of the hitbox data that I've kind of posted everywhere. So um, what I wanted to show you guys is that I kind of verified that the stuff I'm doing is correct and I wanted to show off exactly how close it is. So um, I have Street Fighter V open and I have the characters locked to a specific spot. So um, no matter what I do, every single time they change state, they're going to return to the same spot. So if I do a move and after the pushback happens, the characters get locked to whatever distance I want. So just to kind of illustrate that, like I could have them be three units away, I could have them be one unit away, or I can set it back to what I just had, which was like 0.5 units away or something. So I um, just wanted to open this up. So I've added a couple new things to this. And the most important thing, I think, is that um, you get to see the hurt box range, the hip box range, and the disjoint of every move now. And there's also some other stuff like um, hitbox IDs and whether they hit mid, high, low, or if they're unblockable or whatever, but um, that's pretty self-explanatory. But anyway, this is Ryu Standing Medium Punch, and it has a hitbox range of 1.150. So um, I'll get the game back up, and I'll get the characters 1.15 units away. And... Stadium medium punch hits, but as you can probably tell, it's like this isn't max range for standing medium punch. And that's because I'm not factoring in another important thing, which is how wide the hurt box of characters are. So um, on my site, I'm going to scroll up to stand. And Ryu standing has a hurt box range of 0.35 units. And one thing that's kind of interesting is crouching is 0.1 units wider and that's a pretty universal thing. I think almost all the characters are a little wider when they're crouching than they are when they're standing. So um, let's take our 1.15 value I was talking about and add this to it so we get 1.5 which should be the maximum range that a standing and medium punch will hit. So let's try that out. So According to my data, exactly 1.5 range, hits at 1.5, looks pretty far to me. But the question is, how accurate is this? And this is kind of what I wanted to illustrate. So right now I have them at 1.5. So just for fun, let's try 1.6. A little bit further away. And the move now whiffs. So I'm at least accurate to within 0.1 of a unit. But let's try a little closer than that. Let's try 1.51. So at 1.51 it doesn't hit either. So now I'm going to try 1. 1.501. One point five zero zero one. One point five zero 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 one. So um, I'm not going to go through all the numbers, but I have pretty much figured out that the uh, the information available on my site is accurate down to about one one thousandth of a unit in game so anyone who's kind of worried about you know making judgments based on uh, data provided on the site don't worry about it it's pretty pretty much as accurate as you're gonna get if there are moves that have weird boxes that you can't really figure out without um, by looking on here and they seem wrong um, Feel free to hit me up on Twitter and let me know. But so far, from what I've seen, everything on here is perfectly accurate. And, you know, I will be using this data to update Kinbot for Street Fighter V. 
So that's going to be kind of fun and exciting. And um, that's about it. So thanks for watching the video. Bye.